I want to see if I can transport all this on a bicycle. My inspiration came from seeing this bike on the internet. It's a homeless person's bike and he put together with just string. I wanted to see what I can do without welding, using wood, and just some basic hand tools. The backbone of this frame is basically a 2 by 4 Carefully measured out the gooseneck and the seat post and drilled my holes. That pretty much is it. To support the overhanging uh, load up front, I installed this little 45 degree brace, V'd it, and put it right to where it sits on the steering cup. On the rear here, I just uh, put two boards that attach to the luggage carrier. To keep the load from going into the rear wheels, I rested the 2 by 2s against the frame. A little board in the center keeps the luggage from collapsing in on the rear wheel. Altogether, this thing only weighs 40 pounds, including the bike. I fabricated this little T-bar to keep the bike up with the heavy load. Also, I needed a little wedge to keep the bike from wiggling around while I was loading it. And I created a little satchel where I have all the storage rope and the wedge. This is a, how it looks all put together. Sixteen penny galvanized nails were used to attach the 2x2s to the 2x4, and I pre-drilled some holes and put the 16 penny nails for a little hinge point too. I use little rubber bands to keep them up too when I'm traveling. Here you see me loading the cargo. It's not an easy affair. This is basically just for emergency purposes. So you'd uh, want to prop the bike up against something sturdy to start off with. So if an EMP comes, you don't have a car, don't have communications, things get a little panicky in the city, you want to head out, this might be a good alternative for taking a lot more than just a suitcase. Ever notice that how some refugees you see on the news are carrying suitcases? How much does that carry? And how long you got to last carrying a suitcase? Here. You can walk alongside your bike, no great effort. Going up a hill might be another matter, but still, you're able to carry a lot more possessions than you normally could, if being on foot. strap this down better but basically you're just taking the tubs that you might have at home and fashioning your 2 by 2 length to the shape of your tub. I drove a nail in each end of the 2 by 2 just to loop the uh, rope around and the simple little knot here just to cinch it all up. So if an earthquake comes, a EMP, whatever, shit hits the fan, you've got an idea here. A way to pack up your bicycle and get on down the road. Thanks for watching everyone. Have a great day.